Hello everyone and welcome to yet another exciting episode of Universal View. Today we will be talking about empaths and their relation to animals. <laughs> I love animals. I think they're adorable. And I've learned something recently that I think is worth sharing. So for those of you out there who are empaths, let me just give a little bit of a preface as to what an empath actually is. You can have telepathy where you can read someone's thoughts, or you can have empathy where you can read someone's emotion. The interesting thing about empathy and telepathy is that it can occur regardless of distance. This is where subjects like remote viewing come, come into play, but I get ahead of myself. Anyway, I was doing a bit of research and I realized that animals are rarely healthy for empaths. And this is just something that I'd like to pose to you. If you're an empath, do you find that your animals calm you and make you feel better emotionally? Like do, do their energies provide you with some form of tranquility other than the fact that they're completely adorable? <laughs> Let me know. All right. Thank you for watching. As always, love yourselves. This is me and Sigi chilling. Yeah. He wanted cuddles, and now he's on top of me. What you do? Hello. 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 This chair. I mean, man, you just keep it on it. I'm documenting you. You're being documented, puppy. Look at you. You just want cuddles. You just want lovings and cuddles. Isn't that right? Oh, okay. Oh, there we go. Oh, all right. <laughs> Thank you.